Yeah, she's, uh, she's a bit of a warm one today. What's up, guys? How's it going? Mark Freeman 408. Mr. McNine, he's alive. He's back. He's back in action. So two things I want to talk to you guys about real fast. 80% of my viewers are not subscribed, so I suggest you hit the subscription button right now. I'm not one of those guys to be like every video, hey, subscribe, hit notifications, hit this, buy my merch. But this video, we're gonna talk about it real quick. Yeah. And so. about 99% of his followers are not following me <laughs> on Instagram. So Brad MC9. Cause we wanna cover him with ketchup cause he hates ketchup. I get ketchup. 10,000 followers, you can shoot me with ketchup. I'll vomit, I hate ketchup. So your job today, subscribe, hit notifications, follow Brad. And another thing, this is just a merch thing. I'm not making you guys buy anything, but so obviously, you know, we have Team 408 merch. Well, this shirt we actually designed for uh, Brennan from Gold Rush. I don't know if you guys watch Gold Rush, but you know, he runs the old excavators. So it's perfect. if you guys watched last season, uh, there was a watch team. <laughs> is it? Oh, wow. Oh. Throws great. Throws great. So anyways, this is a limited edition shirt that we made just for Brennan, just for Gold Rush this season. And uh, obviously I made a few for, you know, the boys here, but uh, we weren't selling it. But then I posted it and it got so much traction that people want to buy one. So let us know if you guys want this shirt. Because if you do, then we will put it for sale. Maybe we'll do a pre-order thing. I don't know. See if there's time. So this is Check it. it out. Check it out. We're going to do two more designs as well. Probably a different color. Team so. LTD quality. Fits well. Brad approves. If Brad approves, that's a good stamp yeah. of approval. So anyways, we're down here at the track. She's, uh, she's getting a little grown up, but that's fine. Are we going to park a couple cars at top and jump a car into a car? We could. We I could, think we need to jump a could, car into a car. Into a car? Well, yeah, we the can kids, try. The fans, they want to see smash up. And I like smash ups. Well, we're gonna make two videos today. We're gonna jump a car and then we're gonna maybe do a little race and install a lift kit on Brad's Razor. So, yeah. Brad got a lift kit from Perfex Industries. They're out of Quebec. These guys are awesome to deal with. They already sent spacers, perfect fit. I think you can order their stuff from Revco and a few other places. So, they're, they're, they've been around. And there's no duty when you order this and stuff. And it's from Canada. It's no duty. Yeah, if you're Canadian. So, okay. Look at this thing. Oh God, this is a pretty Do you want good to shape. dent the minivan? Dent the freaking. Look at, no, like this. I know it's too good for you. I was I was gonna sell that door. That's solid. You're not selling anything. Actually, I do have an air pump. We should pump this tire up. Now I can't remember what did. No, I think they're all good to go. The XL7 over here. Is that a Saturn? No, it's a Suzuki. Oh, okay. Was, have you not seen? Have I'm you not been watching the videos? I Saturn before, I thought. Oh yeah, they're. Right I'm pretty sure they're Saturn. basically a Saturn. We Ooh. bent the frame on it though, and the uh, the door won't. Well, it closes. It doesn't like to open now. Yeah, Marcus jumped it backwards, but this thing is a weapon. I should get you you to jump it backwards. I actually, when I edited the video the other day, I was in a rush and I was throwing so many clips in, I forgot to put the second jump in. <laughs> But the first jump was still in there. So. Do you want to jump it backwards? Where are we jumping at? Those little, that little tiny tabletop over there. Marcus did. Take a set of nuts on him. Take a pain pill before I do it. Marcus is a young little buck. Okay? <laughs> You're this. Con uh, Twelve concussions. <laughs> two kids. Two three ex-wives. Okay? I got a hip that just goes out of place all the time. Like <laughs> I never know what it's doing. <laughs> oh man. I'd say let's let's do some dinking around with these. Let's, let's have a race. Let's, uh, yeah, we'll do a race. A side by side. Robin's racing. Robin's racing. Racing's Robin. Or do we jump one right now? Let's we'll jump one right now. Here's you know why. Let's park one right there. Well, you mean push one up to the top? Let's push one to the top. Jump it. Hit it. All right. Because if we wait till later, we always screw around, then the cars and then we get tired, we and it. then we're just over it by the end of the video. If we tried rush, there. and the jump doesn't work. Okay, let's. Jeep I think this thing's all-wheel drive. What's the, what's the back say? Oh, it's got the AWD. Let it go. Yeah. Let her fly. Well, no, this will be a nice thing to push the other vehicles out. So let's okay. push like the Honda Fit up there. I think that's the only one that's probably gonna gonna roll, move, <laughs> and then. I mean, so these I'm, four are running. These four are running. These two are full of scrap, so they're super heavy. So I'm thinking we jump, this thing flies. Okay. I'm thinking we jump the, the Gravette 
Dude, oh, this game, thing came from Bracebridge. Wow. Cottage country. Hey. I'm thinking we jumped this today. Okay, I think if this thing flies, it's going to hit the car on top. We're going to see a full another rotation. Land perfect, second jump. Second jump. Yeah. I don't know if you watched Ford Fusion last week, but we almost got three jumps out of it. I saw it. The whole freaking front end was like hanging there by a thread. Axle was still Step connected, on. still There's moving. Ford Fusion. She's yeah, yeah, we got rid of it. So we did some cleaning up here. As you can see, it doesn't really look like it, but we got rid of, I think, two cars, and he's coming to get uh, two more. So. I think that thing's going to look at this hitch. Just taunting me. I know. You and still we... want that thing, yeah. Right? <laughs> that thing is not coming off. Grind her down. If you want it, you got to take the whole car with you. <laughs> okay. You can tow this car behind your truck and use that hitch. Oh, let's uh. this up here. Where's the keys? Yeah, the well, let's, well, we had to figure out what we're doing. So let's get the keys for the... The G6, the Suzuki, and I imagine hopefully we can push this. I don't know if the keys are on it. Obviously, it doesn't bad. work anymore. As long as we can steer it. Keys in it? I don't know. I don't think so. No keys. All we got to do is line her up from here. Yeah, you we'll, built these ramps right, they should be perfect. We'll line her up. Or we put the minivan up top and just let her fly. I guess it'll still drive after. Oh, hundred percent! It'll be hilarious. Let's do a minivan. All right. Let's do it. Where's the keys? Screw the minivan. All right. Let's go get the keys. Because Brad, you've been on vacation for a full week, and I can tell. You know what? That no, large. No. It's almost time for an XL. I'm already back. Those are my biceps. Maybe I was working biceps all week. Worked out this morning. We're, We're gonna work out after this. Lunch? Musky fishing, yeah. more like drinking beers. There was no, there was no fishing, <laughs> but a lot, no, a lot of casting. A lot of casting. Yeah. Uh, all right, let's get a key. Let's go. We got to do um, a handful of uh, air pressures because all these cars smell pretty good in here. <laughs> well, CMLTD sent me a bunch, but I think they're up the, oh, at the hoose. Well, we'll go ask Rob. Red on red. Since I don't live there anymore. We're not allowed in. Yeah, COVID. Um, oh, yeah, this thing. You know what, maybe I'll just leave it on this time until you're yeah. in the designated position. Come on. How's your guys' day going? As well as ours? We like to have fun. I'm picking up an F-150 tomorrow, too. Got an F-150 coming. What? You can't touch it, though. Yeah. Hey, guess what? Get... <laughs> this oh. Thing is oh, yeah thing just sags with all that weight in the back too. Where do we put it? Because you never know where the cars are going to go. See if we're going to make it up there. Oh, this better be perfect. Where do you think? You think we should go back a little more? I don't know, I'd say right about here. Right where we are? I would say maybe more towards me though. It's hard to say, because it would be cool if the Pontiac just clipped the top too and oh, yeah. front flipped over it. It's going to be super disappointing if the Pontiac just gets down and run under it. It's going to be awesome though when you're standing on the roof when the Pontiac flies over you. Am I going on here? Yeah. I'll just sit in here. And then if it's coming at you, you just drop down through the moonroof. That'll be fine. Listen, this thing's on its last leg. No, that's the, that's the speed one. The speed pops. I don't know. Yeah. Move it like two feet over towards me. All right, I'll leave this window down too. <laughs> oh man, absolute beaut of a day. If you guys haven't checked out the, the other car jump videos, get on it. Especially the Ford Fusion jump from the other day. Right there, step. Yeah, that's the one. That's the line there. This was the recent car jump. Uh, put that that one down. Yeah. Yeah. Where do we put the GoPro is a real question. I think you put it. Oh, you know what? This would have been a good day for you to bring your GoPro as well. Yeah, it would have. <laughs> Whatever. We It'd be fine. You know what you need the GoPro? Somewhere where it sees the car coming and then block it. Block it. I wonder if we could like... We could probably jam it right here. Oh, you want to put it on the roof? No, I, I like or inside, but like if you put it right here, it'll see the car and all of a sudden, demolished. Blackened. 
goodbye GoPro. No way, I think we should also do is bring the Suzuki to the top of that jump, and then you can stand on that too. That's some extra height. Okay. We gotta get you zooming in a little though. You've been doing wide angle for the car jumps. It's been... And when I edit it, I have to zoom in. Oh. It's been difficult. You might as well just leave the key in there because we're gonna have to move out. <laughs> I, mean, I figured we'd lose the key. <laughs> you never know, she might pop out. She's in. You ready to do this? Let's do it. Team LTD. Team LTD. Shabam. New, new shirt. Look at this playground. Those two things gotta go. Actually, those three things we gotta go. Minivan, good to go. That car just hanging. Will the Suzuki start? Oh, no. She dead? Is it dead? Does it start? Getting breezy. Sorry for the wind gu noise if there is any. Gotta pop that hood. Everything's dead around here. You need trickle chargers and stuff down here. <laughs> Put trickle chargers on everything. All right. Will it start? Will it blend? She's been she's been beating on pretty hard the last week, so. Oh yeah, Suzuki, the Saturn Suzuki. Might as just leave that on there, eh? Just till you get up here, yeah. Right through the bumps, into the minivan. So we trim hedges now. <laughs> right to the top. Bring her up. That's good. <laughs> I think only front wheel drive is working. I think we're stuck here. Oh no. Okay, well, you're stuck. You're good for now. I just park it right here and go. Unless you want to get a run at it. You know what? Get a run at it. All right, I want to see you go. Until he gets completely hung up top. Hopefully he doesn't run me over. Whoop! Right there. Right there. Now I think you might be stuck there. Yeah, I think uh, tailgate's open. That's fine. Say, Good thing the drone and everything's in the back. Where's the all-wheel drive button? And this. I don't know. We were yanking fuses on it the other day, so. Oh, is that me? Is that it? No. Yeah, whatever, it doesn't matter. All right, let's, uh, we'll set up the drone, we'll get the Pontiac going, and then uh, we'll jump, hopefully, into that thing. Fingers crossed. Let's do it. Let's do it. Hey, old G6. I, I totally forgot there's a monkey in here. <laughs> Ooh, hoo, hoo. Like my trademark? I always check for CDs, nothing. No CDs? Oh, no man. cat, no problem. All right, I'm gonna set up the GoPro in the back and see what we can do. Hey, that Suzuki half gas in it. Yeah, we're gonna take it to London later. Nice. Go for a rip. Nice. We're having a bit of technical difficulties. Nothing. She wants to start, but she doesn't want to stay started. Zero. Hold on. Red on red, black on black. Yeah. That's all it does. Can you, what about if you just keep giving her gas? As soon as I try to give it gas, it just stalls out. We need the Pontiac Pros here. What's going on, guys? Got gas? Did you press the exclamation mark button? Yeah, I did. Did you hold it down? Yeah, it's on there now. I am sweating. I got a mofo in here. Come on, car. Don't do this to us. Ah. 
Good shack here. I'm the old pro. I know what I'm doing. I'm a pro starting part. Last time I just jiggled with the fuse box for a little bit. Yeah, I just pulled a few of the relays out. gas in it. Well, what if you turn... Usually when you turn the tank, or turn the key, it tells you. Oh, it is sitting at empty when the key's turned. Oh, really? I think it might be empty empty then. Should we jump the Jeep? Jump the Jeep. Jump the Jeep. Here we go. Back up plan. We are struggling. We're onto the Jeep now, but she's dead too, of course. So let's get her boosted. Let's get something jumped here. Get her jump it. -a we got a mostly flat tire. That's fine. You got your, you got your light on. We're good. There you go. I always put the light on. Oh, it's just in case it gets dark. To guide you home. Yeah. Country road. Brooklyn's learned that song on the piano. Oh, really? I got a duet. I play one side. She can piano. teach me piano later. Even more you. Oh, the old 2.4. It's fast, though. When it wants to be. All right, let's go move my truck, and then we'll line her up at the top. I got to grab the strap, too, so she drives straight. All right. Jeep is good to go. I was wondering why it was so slow the other day. It turns out I just had the traction control or ESP or whatever the Jeep people call it. So got the strap, should drive straight-ish. Let's see how she goes. Do a quick test for you guys. Shut the door, go ahead and drive. Now I'll just turn around. Do for a grass cut down here. I didn't come down for one week. Come back is what it looks like. These tracks are full-time maintenance. I don't know if you guys know that, but especially mine, it's huge. If I built a little track the size of hill, it would've been fine. All right, ESP, off. So it's a neutral. Burr. Oh yeah, she goes. I missed it again. You missed it, eh? I think it gets up and goes a little bit. Yeah, I had to turn ESP out. Do you know what ESP stands for? ESP? Every sexual position. That's not what it stands for. <laughs> Why does it go so fast then? That's true. How's that? Oh, you get it. Oh, cricket and cricket. Oh, cricket. <laughs> All right. Now, next question is where am I going to put the GoPro? Because I had it wedged between the seats of that car. Oh. Get her back and put it right under here. Yeah? And just. Oh, yeah. True, true, true. I should wash the old windows. Yeah. Watch out, gonna get a squirt. Squirting Brad. <laughs> oh, I got a little mate sticker. All right, yeah, let's throw the GoPro there and then be GoPro in it. It's a big curve to that window on this thing. It custom. It's a carve. Big carve. We got the, the Skydio. If you guys haven't ordered one of these drones yet, you should. Go get one. It's super handy. And we're set up. And it's, <laughs> it's on. It's on. It's filming. Uh, no, that's as hard as it goes. I'm going to leave that for you. <laughs> we are good to go. We got the GoPro mount of the year. We got like a rubber boots and newspapers. We sell those two guys. If you want them, check out our store. <laughs> yeah, 99 cents. All right. I'm going to head to the top of the hill. Good luck out there. You, you want it? I'm going to take that. Okay, you can have it. I'm going to go up and stand on my car up here. Okay. All right. See you on the other side. Hey, good luck out there. Well, this is where I'm going on the roof of this beauty, white lightning. She might be stuck there, I think we are, but that's for another episode. This thing has some pep. We're gonna try and get it to fly down, smoke that van. Didn't even see that little guy down there. I think it's gonna be good. Bingo, bango, this guy. I think he's going pee. If he feels like it's going to be a good jump, this is his trademark move. He likes to pee on the back tire. Just a good luck thing. He's very superstitious that way. But hey, let's see if it works. 
He needs a minute. Goodbye. And we're back to another episode of How Far Can the Car Jump? Brad MC9 here with you. We are perched on top of the productions stand. And we're gonna let this baby fly. The object is to jump in the air, smash that van, and land, and then we take it up for another jump. That's goal number one. A little bit of a scrap yard down here. Here we go. We're still waiting here, folks. Just thought I'd tell you about an offer. We're offering rental cars. We got a we got a few beauties to choose from here. This one over here is a discounted rate. You come pick it up. You actually get to keep it when you're done with it. So let us know. That guy down there, she's a keeper as well. Come rent them. We also got a field back there that's for rent. If you want a field to run around in, no, uh, no motorized vehicles. You just got to run. Yeah. Maybe we could rent out that field up there too. Just for running around. If you guys feel like running around. It's $37 an hour. Kind of a fun park we're starting here. You just let us know. We want your feedback. We want to know how to make uh, the fun park better. The rental company here. He's a rent to own. They could be yours. We're still waiting, guys. Let me tell you about the next offer. We also got this beauty here. She's got a little leak in the roof only because somebody was standing on the roof and jumping on it. But this one's uh, for the right price. It can be yours. That van, it's got some good body panels on it for now. But we, we'll see where it goes. We're just trying to sync up the old drone here. Look at him there. He's just reaching for the stars. Loving it. Hey? He's got his high school vehicle beside him. Alright, we're synced. We're synced. And we're back for the main event. Drones in the air. Cars turned on. She's gonna start revving soon. And fly. Here we go, she's on, and we're gone. Oh my god! And we're gone. We finally put a van here and it clears it. Dude, it cleared it. It didn't even touch the other side. I felt like she kind of drove a few more feet there. I might go again. That was crazy. It's always Jeeps. They're so fast. Coming down. Look at this. Look at the impact right here. Like We cleared everything. She running? like crazy it actually doesn't look too bad yeah. I put the beacon for the drone in the glove compartment and all that steel that was in the back move forward yeah <laughs> wow that thing flew oh my god like look at this impact she's a bit indented there but it's actually How's that wheel? Time to go, bro. Perfect. Let's start her up. I'm excited. Right, let me land this thing real quick. Check that out. The old Skydio. Go check these guys out. Skydio drones. They're incredible. Easy to use and awesome. I'm just kicking around with it. He's just fooling around with it.
Atlanta in the grass over there? And whoa, fingers. Watch the fingers. <laughs> it's good. Risky, risky. I feel like it's going to start again. Oh. It wants to. It does not smell good in here. No. Pop the hood. If the hood opens. Oh, come on. Woo. It's a heavy knock here. Oh yeah. Well, the rad's pushed right in here. Can't even shift anyway. So if it starts, it's coming right at me. Oh. Well. I think we're shutting you down, boys. You know what I think we do? We put that van all the way up there. We should probably use that thing to try and take that van out. You know it's not gonna happen. But you know it's gonna jump right over it. Then we're gonna waste two cars. But it won't. I'm I saying. think we need to end this video. We're gonna start a new one. Oh my god. Uh, we're gonna have a little race, then we're gonna go put your your lift kit on. Lift kit time. The I razor. I can't believe this thing though. That was that was incredible. That was crazy. Like I'm just watching it and it's picked up so much speed like I like, got things gonna clear the van by it a mile. It cleared it. Like I would love to see the other Jeep video. Yeah. And see I'm, which went first. I want to see the drone video. Yeah. Like, we'll watch it after this. Yeah. You might want to come a little closer. She's a little windy. She's a little windy. But uh, yeah, I was watching it go down the path, and it's like it turned left a little, but not not that much, and it just kept picking up speed. I'm like, holy! I'm like, this thing's. The minivan doesn't have a standard chance. We might as well just park the minivan over here. We should have just what parked we it. Should have done is push that car. I'm over. totally disappointed. I'm really. You know, this is a great. This is a great jump. But I wanted to see a car get smashed off the top. This is your fault. You wanted this. Let's do that. Look at that guy. Let's send him. I can't wreck them all one day. Well, what are we gonna have for next week? Well, I we've done this before. We have. We have. One day and then we have. Like, well, it was a great video. Now what? I'll be honest. What's gonna happen is you're gonna come out, screw around with that, blow it up over there, and it's not even gonna get to jump. That's fine. At least we got a sweet jump video here. It's an all-wheel drive magic machine. All right. Well, here's what we're gonna do. Lock it up. Lock it up. Go to the Scadio website. Pick yourself up a Scadio Two drone. They're amazing. I just they're the next best thing since freaking sliced ketchup. Oh, hey, ketchup. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. If you have any suggestions for videos, let us know. We're picking up an F-150 tomorrow, so hopefully that goes well. It's a little, I think it's slammed, so it should maybe be a little low. Oh, low. yes. But uh, then I had a cool idea for a burnout video, too, so we'll talk about that later. But for now, we're out of here. We're going to go hit the sauna like a couple of good guys. Yeah, big jump in the pool, sauna, fist bump, boom. Thank you guys for watching. Subscribe and notifications. Subscribe and notifications. Follow Brad McKnight. Boom. We'll see you guys later.